Um, I am Shay Universe, and this is me, Uncovered. <laughs> oh no, now I'm gonna start Googling, okay. <laughs> Shay become Shay today? A lot of things, you know, but I, th I guess the inception of me starting to sing started in church, because I was born into the church. I started singing in the choir. And um, it's a bit generic, you know, because a lot of singers start off in church and stuff, but what really gravitated me towards music is really like the power that music has to invoke emotion and feeling. The first time I ever felt that was in church, listening to gospel and like feeling something bigger than me and being like, wow, like this moves, do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's just, that's, that's what I aspire to do. It inspired me to want to move other people. And then it's like, God bless me with the gift, so it's like, why not, you know? I grew up on like Luther Vandross, Barry White, Anita Baker, like just a feel good, like soulful, you know what I mean? Soulful sound, so it's definitely always been there. The song Say Yes is very special to me because it's one of the songs that I grew up on. I heard it played very frequently throughout my household. And so I guess I have a sentimental attachment to it in that way, in terms of like, it kind of takes me back. It has like a nostalgic feel, reminds me of like my childhood and growing up. I've had a couple recently, you know? I've actually had a couple. Now that you asked me that question, I'm like, rah, the levels are, ch levels are changing. <laughs> My most memorable moment to date, to be honest with you, it does have to be performing um, at Twickenham Stadium. So I opened for Eminem when he had like some UK shows. The Twickenham Stadium capacity is 80,000. 80,000 people. That's like the, the most I've ever performed to. And like, it was such an exhilarating experience. That's probably one of my, my most memorable achievements to date. Patrice Russian, forget me not. Y'all, y'all don't know about that. You y'all don't know about the throwback, okay? You need to go and check out Patrice Russian, first and foremost. Patrice Russian, Forget Me Not is a song that I wish I wrote. Yes. It's just like it doesn't matter where you are, like who you are, you play that song, you just start to feel good instantly. because I'm a black woman. I'm as black as it can get, okay? Like, I feel like it's really important still to create content that relates to people like me. Do you know what I mean? Obviously it's nice to relate to everybody, but the people I'm talking to first and foremost are those that are like me because we experience similar things. We have similar struggles, do you know what I mean? We have similar life experiences. So um, I just found it really important to write something that I felt would resonate amongst my people. as my music changes, as I change, because I'm just a very transparent person, everyone is like, you know, watching that journey happen and um, it's gonna be a fun one, you know? Seeing as it's suitable, because I performed at her show yesterday, I would actually say um, an album called He's Not Mine by Etta Bond. That album, even though it's a, it's you know, a more recent album, it's an album I can play back to back to back to back. Like, there's just tunes on there, so. Um, it's called NGAF, which stands for Never Gave a... <clears throat> and, uh, <laughs> and um, yeah, that song is vibes, timeless music. Next milestone, I think, would definitely to be um, to release my first body of work. I haven't, like, it's so weird. I feel like a lot of people forget that I actually am still somewhat semi in the early stages of my career. Like, I've only got, you know, a couple singles to my name and the features that I have of people, but I actually don't have a body of work, no EP, mixtape, album, nothing. And so I'm really excited to, to get to that milestone in my career, the um, album, so I'm excited. But by the time I'm 30, just know the music I'm gonna be blasting out is gonna blow everybody's heads off because that's growth as a person, that's growth in the vocals, okay? That's growth as everything. So I'm saying by 30, I will have that, that, you know? Ah, oh, matured like fine, sweet wine. Yeah.